Workers at this cemetery in Thais are struggling to keep up. They're now burying on average nine to ten bodies a day. <laughs> Official records have counted around a thousand deaths linked to COVID-19, but infections have been on the rise for a month. Mid-March, 50 new cases were detected every week. That's now risen to around 100 infections every day. We know that these figures greatly underestimate the country's actual disease burden due to limited testing capacities and underreporting, as well as challenges of access to any treatment. As of today, Yemen's humanitarian response plan, which is seeking $3.85 billion, is only 13 percent funded. The only dedicated COVID unit in the country is run by MSF, and they confirm that severe cases are on the rise. After six years of conflict in the country, there are only 11 ICUs for 30 million Yemenis. Three hundred and sixty thousand doses of the AstraZeneca vaccine were delivered last week, out of the two million expected by the end of the year. That's enough to vaccinate just 1% of adults in Yemen.